We're here again with spray paint doing another creative tips and tricks video. Soon we're going to have uh, oh. us show out his progression with his 90s uh, in a real game. That will be a video coming up soon. As you can see, he's still practicing 90s. But today we're going to teach him a new trick that he can learn in order to be good at the game. Bro, I glitched into the ground. I glitched yeah, into the ground. Just uh, press your jump button. Press your jump button. Press your jump. More. Yeah, yeah, and now double tap. I'm like flying. Okay, oh. so today's, you today's tips this? and tricks, today's tips and tricks is both a double ramp, uh, double, a double, double layer ramp rough, where basically you just place a floor or and a wall, or a floor and, uh, there. Yeah, just place. I am deep in concentration trying to 90, which is not yes. working. <laughs> I prefer the method where you place a floor, or a wall, and a ramp. Um, and today's the second thing we're going to teach him is how to triple ramp rough with the floor, the wall, and the staircase. Oh, and that is my 90 tower still working on it, but. Yes, yeah, so he's still working. See, there is some sort of um, progression here. Yes. Yeah. So today we're going to teach him first how to do. The double ramp rush. So come over here. Next to us. Next to me. Uh, I have been teaching him a little. So just place a floor. Floor right there. Or not a floor, sorry. A staircase right here. And then a wall behind it. Then another floor. Uh, staircase right next to it. Above you. And then another. Yeah, right there. Yeah, exactly like that. See, as you can see, ramp rushing is not as hard as people make it out to look. Um, it might take a little bit of uh, practice just to not mess up too much. As you can see, he's still getting used to how, uh, how in, ha having to play on keyboard and mouse and practicing. As you also can see, I am playing on controller now, whereas on the last episode where we were doing 90s, I was playing on keyboard and mouse. Um, I, can, I can do 90s on controller, I just uh, prefer oh, no. doing 90s on mouse. And we are just going to try and um, do this. Soon we're also okay. going to teach him how to do infinite 90s, which there will be a video coming up on that soon. But we're going to go down there and teach him how now to do the double ramp rush. So as you can see, he's already semi got a hang of it. Um, he's just going. He's accidentally... So what you're doing right now, what you're doing is mistake, is um, you're holding... Oh, you see I how just keep putting walls. Hold, yeah, yeah, so what you're doing is you, um, a way to fix that one way, uh, might not be the most ideal, but as you get better with it, you can change that. So how you do that is, um, you know how you're holding down the mouse button, or the left click button yeah. to place it? Instead of holding it down, yeah. place it, like place one thing, and then, um, change it, and then place it again. So don't hold it down, just like, um, click it for every, pl um, thing you place. Yeah, like that. That way, that way you don't have any accidental... No. Okay, you won't have as many accidental presses. Yeah, yeah. So the issue is that you're Bro, looking I up before you. Bro, I can't. No, it's. I keep. I keep hitting shift instead of caps lock, which mm. is my stare. Yeah. Ah. As you can see, it is a bit harder for him, uh, comparatively to some others that might have a better mouse, as he does not have side buttons on his mouse. He only has uh, the regular button, um, the regular left click, right click buttons, and the mouse uh, wheel. So he, for him, it's going to be a little bit harder. For you guys, Bruh, it might be easier because, okay. as you can see, it'll be easier if you have uh, these uh, two buttons. I don't really like doing ramp rushes on the right mouse there, so I'm not the greatest at ramp rushes on the right mouse. But on controller, controller, it is much easier to do ramp rushes. I think it's because the fact that they all have ah. their individual buttons and they're a little bit more comfortable to press instead of having to worry about it. You're gonna be seeing much more controller gameplay from me soon. Uh, I'm also just learning how to play controller uh, as well, so you guys will be able to get more tips and tricks from me as we are playing and progressing through this controller. 
Yeah, okay, so that's gonna be our first episode of ramp rushing. As you can see on my screen right now, I did some decent ramp rushing. It's gonna take some work. I'm gonna teach him. Um, that's gonna be the end of his video, so make sure to check out his perspective. Before we go on here um, and do some other stuff, we're gonna teach him one more form of ramp rushing so he knows to practice that <laughs> when he's practicing as well. This form of ramp rushing is a uh, triple ramp rush, which as we showed you somewhere here, uh, is basically placing the floor, stair, and wall. See, he's already got the hang of it. Triple ramp rushing, for me, seems to be a bit easier and simple to do than wall and stair ramp rushing, just because with the triple stuff, you don't have to worry too much. Okay, the mistake you had right there was the fact that you looked up a little too much when you placed the staircase. No, when you placed the floor. So you just have to make sure that you don't look too far up when you place the floor. Yeah, right there. Um, another tip for this, oh, no, what up. you can do, which, another tip for this, place the staircase, place the staircase, then the floor, then the wall. So place stairs, floor. Okay, we are going floor. to try that. Okay, so yeah. staircase, floor, ah, no, no. wrong button. Okay, staircase, floor, wall. Staircase, staircase floor, floor. Wall. Okay. You just ran so no, no. So what you want to do? What you want to do? Your mistake is you're up here when you place the floor. Just make sure you're like down right here at the start of the staircase when you place the floor. That way okay. you can just go like that. Because if you're up here and you try to, uh, if you're up here and you try to place it, then it's immediately gonna place it. Up. We're just gonna go up a little bit and watch him. Ah, a political of me again. That's fun. Okay, we're going to build out. Soon we're also going to have a um, editing tips and tricks video coming out so we can teach him how to edit as well. But as you can see, he's already got the hang of it. Now all he needs to do is just practice this a little bit every single day. As do you guys, and soon you will be able to do ramp brushes quite effectively and in pub and arena matches. Okay, okay that's going to be the end of this episode. Yes. See you guys in the next one.